This is my camera. There are many like it, but this one is mine. The Sony A7S II. It's not the best camera out there these days, but I still love it. And when you love something, you accessorize it. For added functionality, of course. What's up guys, my name is Mark, and in this video I'm going to talk about my top five favorite everyday camera accessories that help make shooting with this thing a little more functional. Number one, the Hoodman Hood Eye. Simply put, it's an eye cup, and it does three things really well. One, it blocks out extraneous light, making manual focusing vintage lenses with my uh, Mark I eyeball much easier. Two, it makes the act of manual focusing much more comfortable, which I never thought possible. This thing is like a pillow for your eye. Number three, and this is an important one, it helps keep my eye the proper distance from the viewfinder glass, reducing the amount of oil and dirt from getting on that glass. Now I shoot left eye dominant, but keep my right eye open to see what's happening in the periphery, so I find this eye cup really helps with that technique. Now this one is for my Sony, but they have versions available for all major camera brands. And if you do a lot of manual focusing or video shooting, I couldn't recommend this thing more. Number two, Photodiox adapters. Now there are so many different brands that make these adapters. And when I bought my first vintage lens, it came with a Photodiox adapter. Now it worked perfectly, so I just never really bothered to switch brands moving forward. Now these little adapters have had the biggest impact on my photography and videography. They are the connection point between the old and the new. And for me, that's been a complete game changer. Now the best part is if I ever decide to switch camera brands, my existing vintage lens collection can easily migrate over with a simple $20 adapter change. Number three, the Peak Design Strap Slide Light. Now, a good camera strap is probably the most sensible investment you can make for your camera. For me, it needs to accomplish three things. It needs to be secure, versatile, and adjustable. A lifetime warranty wouldn't hurt either as a bit of a bonus. Your camera and lens are expensive, so when you hands-free to, say, climb a tree, you want to be confident that your strap will keep your investment safe. There's also a time during shooting when you don't need the strap, so being able to quickly remove it makes life a lot easier thanks to these little dangly anchors. Now, I love the fact that this strap is so easy to adjust. Depending on how I'm carrying my camera, I can quickly make adjustments to suit my carrying style. It's also got a lifetime warranty, so it's probably going to be the last camera strap I'll ever buy. Number four, the SimMod variable ND filter. Now because I mainly shoot run and gun video, a variable ND filter is a must have, thanks to that 180 degree shutter rule. Now I did a comprehensive review on the SimMod variable ND filter last year and listed all the technical reasons why I love it. Now, even with all the other options available, it's still, in my humble opinion, the best variable ND filter for the price. With minimal color shifting, clearly marked min and max points, plus a separate locking ring, make it versatile and dependable. Number five, the Sony battery pack. Now, one of the not so great things about the Sony a7S II is the battery life. Sony gives you two batteries, which in a way kind of make up for it, but you still always have to have the second battery sort of floating around on your person, which isn't always ideal. Also, being a mirrorless camera, it's nice and small, but shooting stable video with this smaller camera body can be a little tricky. Now, a solution for both these issues for me 
has been a battery grip. I love this grip. The quality is equivalent to the camera, the feel of the buttons perfectly matches the camera, and the functions all mirror what's on the camera body. The battery tray is a great combination of function and ease of use, and the buttons on the grip can be turned off completely to block any unwanted presses when the grip is in use. It also makes shooting vertical portrait shots a lot more comfortable. Not to mention the added ergonomics make handheld video shooting a lot easier. That said, the grip is crazy expensive. And for the life of me, I can't understand how it retails for so much. There are third party options that go for way less, so that's always an option. Now I did get this one for way less than retail, thanks to a very robust used market. So check there if interested in a brand name one. For me, it's been worth it, and I appreciate the extra battery life and ergonomics it brings to this camera. So that's it guys, my top five favorite everyday camera accessories that make shooting with this camera a little easier, more fun, and more comfortable. Now I am curious to know how you guys show your cameras a little love. What are some of your favorite camera accessories? i love to know. Well, that's it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Boxes are defeated. Purpose always fleeting. I poise questions to the ceiling like an answer gonna come. Truth is too revealing. Life is easy at concealing. All emotions to the star on your heart going. <clears throat> God, it's been three weeks since I've shot anything. That's entirely too long. I've got some new lenses I'm dying to test out. Coming soon.